Good afternoon, my fellow freedom fighters. Welcome to a, another segment of walking on the Ryerson Station State Park Warpath. Just like last week, I'm as I told someone today when I was in Waynesburg, summer beat spring to the finish line. <laughs> but and by doing that, everything's in bloom here in western Pennsylvania. I just have to show you this beauty of spring in bloom. Like I said, super boosted by summer. This is really, I like this red. I don't know the names of these bushes. I should know them. But anyways, yeah, this is a... Uh, Another beautiful time here in Greene County, Pennsylvania, and uh, like I said, that smell in the air. I always say that I smell the fear of our government, but that's spring. <laughs> and fear of the government, and a new one, I have to add. Like I said, this is the starting. Sorry, bear can't go in the woods today he's gonna be mad he's gonna start barking but uh <laughs> the treason treason the smell of treason in the air and I you know what it really makes me angry I know a lot of you know that I'm not a really big fan of Jan Napolitano and I, I uh I think they should change their names to uh like a Chinese name or something anything but Italian American because Italian Americans are patriotic traditionally patriotic and uh, like Leon Panetta that's what this one's about uh, and as always the champion of truth Alex Jones covers it but uh, Leon Panetta admits that the, the US military and Obama take orders directly from the United Nations traitors and I feel we are the voice of our soldiers my friends and it's time we have to take control of this ship called the United States of America where freedom began we we the people have to take charge and there's no way they're they're out in the open they're crazy these people are crazy treasonous bastards and I I will not let our sons and daughters be dictated by the United Nations no this is the United States of America my friends we have to call call your congressman and tell him the gig's up. We have to uh, show them who the bosses are because they're just out. Like I said, they're out in the open and they're they're treasonous bastards, every one of them. And like I said, Shane, uh, Leon Panetta, change your god darn name because you aren't an Italian American. You're a treasonous bastard being taken orders from the United Nations what the hell's wrong with you get the hell out of office all right as always go check it out this is the first part of a patriotic show like the days of old of good television this is the beginning this is this this video is the start of the rest of the show which is on my the link is right at the bottom of this video go check it out uh, and I, like I said, as always, Alex Jones takes it away for you in the second part on my website. Pass my website and my video to your friends. And I must announce, I'm very proud that I'm at 8,362 miles after today's 10 mile march. No, uh... No person, no civilian in the history of the world has walked this far 
for the love of their country with their flag. This is flag 17. Every, every American flag gets 500 miles on it and then I donate it to a, uh, I give it away to a unit or a soldier or a patriot leader who have been uh, over the last 10 years since 9-11 like our soldiers who have been over and or our veterans excuse me a veterans group because I'm inspiring my main goal as I'm running for Congress again uh, for the third time and like I told a patriotic friend Judy she actually uh, a lady was marching for the troops just like I was when I started she was marching too uh, from another part of the country we she she found me again on Facebook and I told her I said my main mission is to inspire our greatest patriots to be leaders and the only way to do that is to run for Congress I will run for Congress as long as I'm alive with the third party never with the Republicans or the Democrats because they're treasonous pigs see you guys in the next video 8,362 miles. Yeah, baby. <laughs>